What's going on guys? Welcome to another video. I'm actually out here on the beautiful Lake Lanier and I want to go out here and try to catch them. It is super foggy. It's actually just now blowing over since that sun's kind of peeking through. But when I pulled up a minute ago, like I don't know if you guys can tell by the main lake over there, it is foggy and it's not even like it's not it's later right now. It's like 10 o'clock. I didn't even uh, try to come out here early so it's pretty crazy but I'm gonna come out here just try to have some fun film a video for you guys today and hopefully get some cool footage I hope you guys are enjoying um, the quality right now I don't know if it's the best let me know below this is actually filmed with my iPhone so I'm trying to branch off you know this the iPhone quality is so amazing if you guys follow me on Instagram you guys just know like most of the pictures are pretty high quality are all off of the iPhone and uh, of course I edited them a lot and I put a lot of time into that but for the most part, I mean, they're off the iPhone. It's just absolutely amazing. But let's see if we can go catch some fish. I'm gonna stop talking. Let's go get it started. Guys, that was that was about a three and a half pounder. These spoon hooks are just so it's so hard to get them. That was a good one though. Let's see if we can get one. There we go, guys. Guys, my camera literally died when I hooked that one, and he was about three and a half. It's two, pretty much three pounders. I just lost. And I'm about to tie a new spoon on because this hook absolutely sucks. And I mean, it's hard to keep them pinned anyways, but this one's just horrible. So I'm going to see what I got. I think that would have been good to know if, you know, my hook pulled off. I just now looked at it and I actually thought I had a bite earlier. And uh, yeah, yeah. What is my luck lately? I, I just don't get it, man. I had enough. These fish are getting in the boat. I put big boy on. We're gonna try this one out now. So guys, I just wanna debrief on what just happened in here. So, I pulled to the spot. I haven't been having too much luck. You know, I, I know I need to be fishing some ditches and some timber. And I pull up here, I ended up losing two. I, I lost one that was about three, lost one that was about three and a half. And I'm on the same bait, so I was like, screw this, you know, I'm getting a new hook. Um, changed baits like 50 times, put different hooks on. That second fish I hooked, I actually hooked him in 50 eight foot of water 58 foot of water that that is unreal i hooked him in like 58 foot and he was god he was a good one I, he came up well, the gopro shut off so you guys can see it he came up and he just started taking off and he's just gone i mean i got him close to the bank but i mean there's nothing i can do and of course the gopro died so you guys couldn't see it but uh, i'm gonna keep him running around i don't have too much time on my gopro left so i'm just debating on what to do but let's let's see if we can go wax him <laughs> Finally, guys, look at the color of that fish. That's crazy. That's a good one right there. Finally, finally, we're getting on to him. There's a knot in my line. There's a knot in my line. There's a knot in my line. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Did I really 
just do that? <laughs> oh my god, guys. Look at that. <laughs> I just got him with my hand. <gasps> there was a knot in my line. I felt him hit it, in my, and it hit it so hard that it knotted my line up. I started to reel it up. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Ooh, I ain't the biggest, but he's decent. There you go, guys. Look how fat he is. All right, guys, excuse the noise in the background, but I kind of want to show you guys what I'm doing to catch these fish because it's totally bizarre and it's like something that. You know, I'm not too familiar with, and I haven't done that much. And I've never caught any fish, if you guys are wondering. I'm catching them around 50 to 60 foot. That, that is deep, guys. <laughs> most lakes are, don't even go to 50, 60 foot. You know, most lakes are, you know, 20, 30 foot. So, I mean, that's just bizarre. Um, Lake Lanier, you know, Lake Lanier is a deep lake. Um, it goes all the way up to, I know there's places by the dam that I've seen there, like close to 200 foot, 200 foot. Um, so let me show you guys what I'm doing. Finding some ditches. Not only am I finding ditches, I'm also fishing road beds and I'm also fishing some submerged like standing timber that's out here. And I'm throwing a little, or I'm not throwing, I'm dropping a little flutter spoon down on these fish. And most, I mean, some of you guys aren't gonna know how to read a graph, but I'm gonna see if I can find what I'm doing. Um, I'm gonna see if I can find some, some timber that I'm dropping on. As you can tell, I'm in 35 foot now. I've I mean, today I haven't really caught any fish around 35 to 40 foot. It just hasn't been as good. Um, 50, 60 foot range has been the best. See that drop off right there and there's all that stuff right there. Got some trees. I know it's hard to tell right in here, but that's actually a fish right there. I can tell you that. That's not fish. It's so hard. It's so hard to explain how I'm reading this stuff, guys. Um, it's, it's all about trial and error, really. But I'm dropping this spoon all up in this stuff, you know, jigging it up and down. So let me let me show you the combo I'm using. Right now, I actually put this on a fate black. It's actually on a medium. Medium rod is perfect for the jigging. You know, I got a little bit of tip. Got that bend when I go to hook set. Right there, that's not a standard jigging spoon, but that's actually what I had on to catch, you know, my final fish today. And this is on a 7-3 to 1 gear ratio reel on 15 pound line. And this is a concept A reel, if you guys were wondering. That's what I'm doing. And see as you can tell a timber down there there's trees down there i'm just dropping straight down on that and jigging up and down here's a better look at what you guys are seeing on that other graph as you guys could probably not tell as much see that's a tree laid over right there so when you guys were probably looking at me say oh that's timber oh, that's trees see you can tell I, it just looks weird on a sonar if you guys aren't familiar with that if you guys were wondering 60 degree water temps today on this beautiful day Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Oh my God, I think I have two on. Oh, I hooked him in the tail. Get him. That fish fought so hard. Look where I hooked him. Jeez, buddy. I had you. Pretty guy. Look how fat he is. Alright, guys, here are the fish. I'm gonna release them. Alright, guys, I'm off the water now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. At the end, I was holding up all four fish. I actually dropped one, then the GoPro died. Yeah, uh, today was just so weird. You know, I lost all these fish and ended up figuring them out and ended up losing all the baits and just all kinds of crazy stuff happening. But if you guys enjoy these types of videos, be sure to smack the like button. Be sure to comment below what you guys think. And also subscribe and hit the little bell. Thank you guys so much for the support. I hope you guys are grinding every single day, putting 150% effort into everything in life. And I'll catch you guys in the next video.